These are genie pants to me. Hey loves, it's Dave back on your screen with another one. Hope you're all well. Today we're gonna do a Aritzia clientele sale haul. Last week, I just happened to be on the website and I saw the black banner and I knew what time it was. You have to go quick because for some reason the clientele happens and then the real sale happens like a couple weeks later. I don't know if it's gonna be for Canada Day weekend or what, but I got a few pieces that I've had my eyes on for a minute. I'm so proud of myself. Usually when the sale drops, I do the most. I spend money I don't have on things that I don't need. But this time around, I got a few pieces that are staples. I'm gonna do a try on haul for you guys to show you how I'm gonna pair them for every day, day and night wear, all of that. When I was planning to do this video, I thought I was gonna get a couple pieces from the Zara sale. You know I'm a Zara-holic, but I went in the store for one thing and I couldn't find it. And just, I can't. I don't know about you guys. I don't know if it's because I'm legally blind, but the anxiety of going through racks, color-coded racks and finding your size just does not appeal. I try to look on the app and I just realized I don't need these things. I have enough as it is. We've been locked up for two years. So some of the clothes I got two years ago, I'm so excited to wear this summer. At the time of filming it, it's officially the first day of summer, so I hope that your summer's off to a good start. I'm gonna share some pieces at the end from J Lux label that I got late winter, early spring, because you know, I'm all about the summertime. If you check my closets, you'll see, it's about 90% summer clothes, and your girl lives in the six. I swear it's 90% winter here. I don't know what I was thinking, but that's what it is. I just love styling the summer. It's my favorite season to wear and dress for. It's shorts for me, you'll see. So let's start off with the first package. The first things I ordered and received were these shorts and this bodysuit. I actually got these shorts in the store and then I placed an order for the stuff I'm gonna show you in a sec. These shorts are in the size extra small. I'll put the name, the color, and the size in the description box below. I'm usually a double extra small when it comes to Wilfred, but if you watch the vlogs, you know your girl needed an extra small. Although, when I put these on, there's a little bit of give, and thank God, these drawstrings are real. You know there's nothing worse than buying a pair of shorts or pants to find out that the button, the buckle of the drawstring is just for fashion? Like, what's the point? Make sure that it can tie and do something. So I'm so happy that the drawstring actually works so I can tighten it a bit. These are perfect as a beach cover-up or to pair with the bodysuit. I like the little dainty lace detailing at the bottom. I was a little hesitant about this crinkle look because it's giving wrinkles and if you're Caribbean like me, you were raised not to leave your house with wrinkles on your clothes. But it actually goes, it gives it that very carefree, effortless, chic kind of vibe. I'm obsessed with this very stark, crisp white. You don't know how hard it is if you're going to a white fed or a party to find a top and bottom that's the same shade of white. I can't tell you how many times I try to do an all white moment and then the bottoms are too white and the top is a little too warm or too cream. So I wanted to get stark white shorts to go with those pieces. Because I'm obsessed with bodysuits and Babaton makes the best contour bodysuits, I wanted to get a strapless version. I have a couple in the t-shirt and long sleeve crew neck version. They're very good staples. I wear them year round. There's cold days in the summer that I put the long sleeves on. There's warm days in the winter where I'll pair the t-shirt with an open sweater. And I figured this is an all round piece too. You wouldn't think for the girl who has over 20 bodysuits that I'd need another one or black. But I was going through, cause I was looking for a black bodysuit to wear with a pair of pants last week and I realized I don't have a simple bodysuit. I have them American Apparel Deep V's ones, or I have an Aritzia one that has all the straps in the back, and sometimes I'm not trying to do all that. I know this is not as simple as it could be, but for the price, I'm not gonna just get one strap here and one strap here. Even though it was $10 off, Babaton is not cheap, so I wanted it to say a little more than just a simple, basic one strap cami. I like that it has the straps that cross in the back. It's a tiny bit lower dip, but you can still wear a bra underneath it. It's got the snap enclosures, which a lot of companies are playing in our face. How do you expect us women to have a fun patio day and not be able to open it from the bottom? Do we have to pull it to the side? Cause I'm not comfortable doing that. I'm just not. So I absolutely love this. There was black, white, and yellow. Black wasn't even on the site anymore, so I had to call Concierge to find which store had it to ship it to me. 
I wouldn't have thought the black would have sold out first in the summer, but it's the color that I needed. So luckily I got my hands on the last one in Toronto. Parcel number two, package number two is another pair of shorts. So remember what I was just telling you guys about the shades not matching, the mats not mathing with the shades? I needed to get a very sophisticated, professional, but understated pair of white shorts. And this is the whitest ones that I could get in this kind of fabric and cut. I wanted something very simple, something that wasn't saying too much that I can pair with a flowy top or a crop top, something that just elevates whatever my basic outfit is, and this fits the bill. I tried on quite a bit, and this one had the best fit. I got this one in a zero. Again, just so I have a little bit more give. You don't want to be out eating and feel like you're restricted because you wore too tight shorts. I think these are called the agency short, but again, everything will be down below. Last package from Aritzia. This one came in a box. I want to know, do you guys know why Aritzia ships packages in a package? I guess it's just their branding, but I always find it funny that they put it in a bag in a bag because you could have just put it in here and saved on that. But once we open this up, this is the piece I'm most excited about. I absolutely love their Sculpt Nip collection. It's actually what I'm wearing. This top I've had for four or five years and it's still holding up. I'm always afraid when it comes to the rib look that one, it's gonna rub and look very pilly, and two, the color's gonna fade. But this is tried, tested, and true. And this is an even lighter shade. I love that they came out with the dress and it's got the simple straps. So you can definitely wear this up, wear this down, do whatever do. I got in an extra small instead of a double extra small because I wanted the little bit of extra leg length. As I'm getting more older, sexiness is sophistication and not showing it all. I like that there's no cutouts, there's no cross back, nothing like that. I have a lot of dresses like that already and I just, it's giving free -cum. and sometimes you just wanna look very just effortless and free. It's a thicker material, don't get me wrong. I will not be wearing this in August when it's hot, hot, hot. Even a day like today, 34 degrees, I could get away with this. But anything other than that, I would not recommend because it is thick with two C's. This could even take you into the fall. I would wear this with high or over the knee boots. So that was a Ritz, yeah. As I mentioned earlier in this video, I went to a black networking event yesterday. It's the first one I've been to in over two years thanks to the panorama. And this is what I wore. I wish I took an Instagram picture for, there will be another day. This is from JLux label and all the other items I'm going to show you for the rest of this video are from there. I adore, can you tell I'm all about this cream shade this season. This is something that is just so effortless and beautiful. I'm all about the just easy but put together look. It has this scrunch with the higher than I remember when I ordered it split, but hey, why are the splits always on the left leg? I wanna know. If you have the answer, let a girl know. This fits like a dream. Well, actually, if I'm honest with you, I really wish that JLux label had extra small because right now their size range is small to XL. They need to get some extra smalls up in there because this fits, but just barely. Like, if I was any tinier, I would probably, this would not be flattering on me. Let's just leave it at that. I like the slight shimmer. It gives it an evening look. I was wearing a dress very similar to this during the day. Came home, edited a bit, showered, and switched into this. I just felt like it was more of a statement for the event that we went to and it's super comfortable. There's nothing better than throwing on a slinky dress for an event and just feeling like you're ready to go. The next thing I have to show you is a set. The first part is this bodysuit top. When I ordered this in March, I was like, I'm doing the most this year. And as you can see, she has not done the most because the tag is still here. I love this low cut because I don't wear this stuff. I figured this would be really nice for a night out. I just don't know where, because where is this girl going? A hot, humid day like today, I probably wouldn't throw these on, especially since I plan to pair them with the matching leggings. They did sell a jumpsuit version of this, but the thing with JLux label is the size range is so limited. Like I mentioned with the dress, small is the smallest size. If they had an extra small option, I probably would have gotten the jumpsuit since that's how I intend to wear this every time. But since they didn't, I figured if the leggings, cause it's always about the crotch to high waisted ratio that throws me off. So if that's all right, or if it's not all right, at least I can get that altered. But it's a lot harder when you have a one piece to get it to fit and sit right without doing major work on it. 
These are so soft, they feel like pajamas. The only thing is when something is as soft as this, I wonder how delicate it is. There's nothing worse than putting on a new fit and having it pill on you on the first time. I hope that doesn't happen. I'll keep you guys posted. Another set I have is in this pretty buttercream color. I don't know if it's my iPhone or my iMac when I ordered this. It did not look this yellow. I was thinking it was going to be more of a faint version of this which would have been perfect because I could still pair it with white, but I don't think this is gonna look good with white. This is one of those multi-way bandeau tops. I think I'm just gonna wear it the one way, like a bandeau, tie knot, simple. Matching bottoms, which I'm obsessed with. Initially, I wanted to get this in ivory so that I could pair the bottoms with a lot of things I currently have in my closet, but of course, they were sold out and they've been sold out. So I may, if they have it back in stock during a sale, just buy the white bottoms by itself. These are what I call genie pants. They're so comfortable, so flowy, so soft. I need to get them hemmed a little bit cause they long and I don't have heels that high. I'll be cleaning the streets with this bottom, but I absolutely love the way they feel, fit and sit. I just wish that buttercream was more of a cream versus this yellow moment. It's not bad, it's not bad, don't get me wrong, but it's just not as versatile as I hoped it would be. But that's okay. And that is actually the end of this haul. I did so good this year. Usually when it comes to summer, I spend twice, if not triple as much as I spent over the last couple of months. So I feel like that's a sign of maturity. You can let me know if you wanna see more hauls. I probably won't do anything until mid fall though. I have no intentions of buying any more clothes for the spring, but if you want like a pairing of what I already have in my closet, I can definitely do that. So let me know down below. I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, tap the like, comment down below what your favorite piece was. And until next time, stay safe, stay sane, stay blessed. Love and later.